What is going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are all well. As you can see, I got a new RC truck, Red Cat Gen 8 Axe Edition. Super fun. It's mine! <laughs> oh no! Surprise! <laughs> <laughs> Actually, this is going to be Mrs. Propaganda's new truck. Uh, we're super excited to have it, so we figured we'd unbox it for you guys. Got my hands on it super early. Not really sure of the deal, but Horizon and both A-Main Hobbies were not showing that they were going to get any in stock till February. And I saw an Instagram post, and it was by rpp hobby and they said they had them in stock so i figured i would order it um we've been thinking about getting a new rc truck for a little while now a new crawler for her but we weren't really sure what to get uh, i already had the element didn't want to get another version of that uh we're kind of looking at the wraith right but you weren't really sure yeah. on that and then this came out and she sent me a picture and said that she liked it so i was like well in february i'll get it and then i happened to see that instagram post they had them in stock and i was like well dang i'm gonna have to get that as a early christmas gift so it's kind of like an early christmas gift for her and it's kind of for me i'll get to check it out and touch it but um yeah it's gonna be really good and uh we're gonna put it to the test but this is going to be a quick unboxing so you guys can get some shots here and see what this thing looks like so let's get it open so exciting. Oh yeah. Let's see how this thing's packaged. So that's the packaging there. Very nice. That's weird. I've never seen this kind of bubble wrap. I like this. This is like little bars of bubble. Poke yeah, you could, but we should save it. Oh, oh wow, there it is. Wow. Show them. Oh yeah. Looks pretty well packaged. Yeah, it looks so cute. Like try, to, try to pull it out, see if you can pull it out. No. I'll, no? Let me take uh, these little booths. Here's the manual. You get that. We'll can get I into, rip this thing off? You can do whatever you want. It's your box. She's new to unboxing RCs. Hey, I haven't unboxed any for a while. probably got zip ties or something you're gonna need uh, some scissors yep that's that's why show them your blade <laughs> typical mexican brings yeah. a straight razor <laughs> the color looks nice yeah it's so nice you're keeping okay. the people in anticipation yeah. they're waiting to see oh oh that's a spare i was oh, like it lost oh, a wheel <laughs> Dude, I got the tire <laughs> I was like, okay put it down what else you got in here? I got a little tire. Oh, well, that's nice. It comes with a spare. I got the screws. Some sort of... The ones I'm missing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you got a few missing, that's for sure. Uh, this looks like it's for the radio or something, an extra grip. So we'll have to get all that stuff Ooh, out. Look at it. Oh, yeah, that's oh. ready. Pull it out. Grab it. What do you think? Initial thoughts. How's it feel in the hand? Wow, mm, it's nice looking. It Let me nice. feel it. Yeah, it's got no batteries. So Oh, wow. <laughs> She's already getting defensive. You see that? Oh, wow. Yeah, it feels It's nice. Good. Yeah, the, the trigger feels not the greatest. Yeah, it feels good to me. Okay. Oh, yeah, a bind plug for the radio because it's the fly sky. Okay, what do you got? Stickers. Oh, it has a little thing. Oh, it has the soft top. Show them the top. Oh wow, that's cool. So here's the soft top. <sighs> nice. The new plastic smell. <laughs> it won't last long. <laughs> wow. Oh, it's all negative. Yeah, total. What do you think? You like it? Yeah. Why is red cat if it's black though? Mm, well, Red Cat's the brand that makes it. Uh -huh. Yeah, you can mount that spare. Oh, there it goes. Ta -da! I'm all set. Oh, wow. I really like how the soft top works. That's cool. See these screws? You must just take the screws yeah. out, and then you can do that. But I wish that they had it so it mounted in the, in the um, back so you could kind of no. roll it up and have it sit in here. 
or if you feel adventurous, you can you wear it as a cape. Yeah. <laughs> 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 okay. okay I don't like if you notice, I'm gonna look it. it. It's got no body pins. No. How's it held on? S see what's up with it. Try to pull it off. See what happens. Oh no. I want to see what it looks like underneath there. I'm scared. I don't know. Just a yard on it. Oh, Velcro. Oh, wow, yeah. This is what the people want to see right here. Oh, whoa. The ESC, they didn't tape it on all the way. That's crazy. Wow. Yeah, they just threw these on. It looks like quick. Oh, yeah, see, it's all soldered on to the motor. Oh, look at the little axe. But that's double side tape. That's not a big deal. See, it I looks... Mean, has a... Yep, yep. Yeah, you got your little switch there. What is this? Oh, that's the zip tie there that you cut off from the wheel. Oh. It's got the center battery tray. Wow, I like that. This is my first time ever looking in depth at a Red Cat. Look at you got the fenders are really nice. They feel nice. Nice little box. Oh, okay. It does have a tube if you want to run the antenna. Oh, this is weird. It looks like it's got. You can plug these in from the outside or is that for does it have lights or anything it's got the bucket so that's nice has lights. i'm trying um, to figure out you can add them yeah you can add the lights i'm just trying to figure out what these plugs are for i don't know if it's like a separate so they're on the outside even though the receiver's in there and it's like some sort of pass through or something you see that Maybe some Red Cat guys know. Wow, the plastics feel really nice. Maybe not the bumper as much, but the fenders, the sliders, tires. Oh, you got all the stickers, yeah. Scout. Oh, is this another licensed? Because it says Scout on it. Or are they just calling it a Scout? I wonder if, because I don't see anything that says International, but maybe they can use the Scout name. But you got your axe motor and then here's something else too i'm noticing look at this they got a, a little bar in here to stiffen up so that way oh wow that's really wild it's a, and it's separate from the the bolts for your shocks so that's really nice mm -hmm. the plastics feel pretty good mm -hmm. it's a cool design and they got the bar in there wow i'm pretty impressed guys i haven't uh, really looked at a red cat a lot here's all the links they're really nice and beefy Mm -hmm. This part of the drive shaft is metal here, plastic here. Feels pretty nice. And here's that new skid plate. Look at how flat that is. This is really nice. Wow, the frame rails are super thick too. Wow, this thing's a little tank. And I guess this is where they did it, a double mounted on the uh, links here. They're having issues somewhere there, I guess, on the older ones. And the other things are going to be in the box. Uh, in the portal box, the, the new gears. Wow, suspension feels really well dampened. There's the portal axles. Get a good look in there at your portals. Looks really nice. Wow, I would have to say I'm really impressed. What do you think? Yeah. What do you think of your truck? I don't know, I can't wait to drive it. <laughs> yeah, she wants to drive it badly. But well, we don't know about the batteries, right? Oh no, it's got a Dean. I got uh, I got battery. I was okay. just joshing with you. <laughs> yeah, she <laughs> fell for my joke. <laughs> I told me. I told her that I, uh, I didn't know what kind of connector. Oh, I'm not gonna have any batteries. I <laughs> I I'll just solder on the next T90. So we got stickers for it. Uh, oh, Mira, you can put the little mats. Oh yeah. Mats. Well, yeah. You should show them the. Um... So it does have. A really well detailed interior, I think. Yeah, you got like the little insides. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you got all oh, for the door handles. Yeah, for oh. the inside. So you're going to have to go ahead and put all those on. I mean, it, it's it's detailed enough. It's got a dash. It's got a wheel. The only thing I'm seeing is the seats aren't very great. They kind of look almost like a race seat. They don't really fit the period. Uh, they look like they're just bolted on, though, so you could probably change them. I'll take them out. Like I'm not attached. sure. It looks like the interior you can remove. I'm not sure. It's hard to tell. 
I'll have to mess around with it some more. How's it? How's it go on though? When you go to yeah. put I was it. scared to pull it. Oh, that's <laughs> not the. No. It's putting it on no. back. <laughs> Oh, okay. Like, Wait a minute, it, go, it, it goes right on, no problems. So yeah. we'll see how the hook and loop or Velcro holds up. I heard that mm -hmm. it's not very good, but it could be climate and stuff. We're dry here, so I'm hoping uh, that it holds up. Yeah. Oh, well, you got a for sale sticker. That's a funny sticker. Yeah, I'll put it on you. <laughs> <laughs> I got all of these stickers. Stickers. Right, I guess you gotta rip this open. I just want to take a quick uh, peek. What is this? Okay, it's the manual for your hobby wing. Here's all your stuff for your fly sky. Reefs. That was another what thing. Is this? That is a bind plug for your radio to get your radio to work mm -hmm. with that. One, two, three. Oh, the one, two. Yeah, it takes four A's. That's nice. Wow, I really like this radio. I really think Red Cat did a great job here. This is really good um, RTR stuff. The body's definitely a little bit on the heavy side, but it feels low. It doesn't feel top heavy. I didn't look at the servo. Oh yeah, there's that Reefs. That Reefs servo in there, that's real nice. It is branded with Red Cat and Reefs. Yeah, has a metal servo horn too, so that's good. Hmm. The portal design is so much different than the uh, Traxxas. So I'm hoping that they hold up. <laughs> if anyone's going to put it to the test, it's really going to be Mrs. Propaganda here. But maybe she'll consider that she has a nice fancy new RC truck and not crash it right away. What do you Ooh. think you're going to add in there for a driver? Uh, ninja turtle. Oh, okay. So we've got to find you some ninja turtles. Some people are mounting these in there. I, I would, can have a passing you. I'd put it on the... <laughs> <See? laughs> right? That would be a really nice... Uh, yeah, you have a turtle and splinter. Yeah. Well, I'm going to find you those tonight. No, that's close. Where do you want to mount it? No, you can't mount it there. You could mount it on the tailgate somehow if you could get something on there. All right, guys, that is going to be it for this video. Thanks for tuning in. Make sure if you're new here, you subscribe. Make sure you like the video. Leave us a comment down below. And as always, we'll catch you guys in the next one. We're out.